What's up guys? Welcome back to Rub My Crypto. Hopefully you guys are doing extremely well today. We're going to talk about internet computer and why internet computer has the greatest technology in cryptocurrency and there is no other that has the technology like internet computer. So what we're going to do is we're going to discuss why this is the most valuable coin for 2024. We got a brand new year coming for cryptocurrency and internet computer will be at the top just as Solana leaped BNB as will internet computer make it up to that top rank of top 10 so let's get into it guys this is internet computer and why it is so valuable for 2020 so guys when i look at internet computer I, I obviously look at all the technology that internet computer has so when i start to compare internet computer with other cryptocurrency projects you know really the the two that stand out is like you know ethereum and then you have solana and you look at both uh ethereum and solana and you put it up against internet computer and then we start to see that you know everything that internet computer does is 100 percent on chain now to look at a project like ethereum or a project like solana you know everything is done off chain so all the transaction is off chain and then you need to actually boot that up to be able to be recognizable on the blockchain so when you look at it you know it's you're saving a lot of data you're saving a lot of storage and it's 100 percent accessible to anybody trying to do transactions on chain so that's a big difference between uh internet computer and mainly every other cryptocurrency project so the technology behind what internet computer has done to be able to produce this on chain also gives it a, a huge advantage in the cryptocurrency space and then as we look forward into their chain key technology they have basically allowed well they built a system where they bring in you know bitcoin and bitcoin is be, being able to be acknowledged or utilized inside the internet computer chain which allows you if you're on a internet computer decentralized app um, application it gives you access to bitcoin it gives you access now to ethereum which now you can, can can basically take you know your internet computer and swap it out for uh, Bitcoin and swap it for Ethereum and they hold uh, basically the values of Ethereum and of Bitcoin. Now any type of utilization that you want to use Bitcoin or you want to use Ethereum, you can now do that by trading the Bitcoin and trading the Ethereum coin on internet computer with less transaction fees and faster speeds with every transaction so it makes it a lot more function functionable on internet computer by saving all the gas fees associated with ethereum and then you know all the fees associated with bitcoin so whenever you're using decentralized apps on internet computer you're able to transact with ethereum you're able to transact with internet uh, computer tokens and then you're able to transact with obviously um, Ethereum tokens as well. So Ethereum, Bitcoin, and internet computer. Now, the cool thing is if you go into um, internet computer's dashboard, when you create a uh, identity wallet, um, the, the neat thing is you could go in there and swap your internet computer for your Bitcoin and for your CK ETH. So you have the CK ETH and the CK BTC, um, which is allows you to be able to swap in between any decentralized apps that are in the uh you know the token swap of uh internet computer now there's other token swaps and that's really what i wanted to get into is um how you could use internet computer uh decentralized exchanges to swap out internet computer tokens for any tokens that are sitting on internet computer so it's always really a good idea to go to the internet um computer ecosystem so i urge you to go on and take a look at uh, some of the, the ecosystem decentralized apps that are sitting on there. It gives you a really good insight of what Internet Computer is doing as far as decentralized apps. And, you know, they put out a lot of grants for people to actually build on the Internet Computer ecosystem. So, uh, yeah, sorry if you guys hear a plane in the background. I got a little base, Air Force base right near my house. So if you guys ever hear planes flying in the background, that's what it is. But uh, so let's take a look at the... Uh, um, the wallets real quick <clears throat> so there's there's quite a bit of wallets that you could use um, here on the uh, internet computer they have like a Astro X uh, which is a it's a wallet where you could swap out and then you have ICP swap um, NFID Sonic Sonic's really good I actually use Sonic to um, 
when I first started being able to swap, you could actually get like the gold Dow um, Origin. So Origin's a probably a good project to look at. We'll talk about that um, in a little bit, but Origin is a real good project that I believe is gonna be uh, very successful to help scale out uh, projects coming off of internet computer. Um, so let's check out, uh, let's check out Sonic. Uh, see this for a second. So right here is where you could actually go and swap. So let me see if I can launch this. And yeah, so this this is where you would connect your identity, your internet identity wallet. This is where I have my tokens at uh, for internet computer. So you would just load up and then you would swap. I don't know if you guys are familiar with using like Uniswap, but this is essentially the same thing where um, you could go in and you know select tokens um, that are on the internet computer chain. So there's a, quite a bit of people using um, there's the gold governance token for gold Dow. The one I wanted to show you guys was the uh, the origin. Let me see if I could bring it up. Yeah, there it is. So this one right here, origin, this is a good project for internet computer. I think it's probably, like I said, it's going to be one of the best that I think personally that ICP has. Currently, the swap for is one ICP for 760, almost 64. Uh, for origin. So let's go ahead and take a look at origin actually. So right here is actually the uh, website for origin which um, this project is digital certificate. So Essentially like you know when I was talking in my other internet computer video, you know, I was saying how um, You know how interesting it would be if we could actually like, you know get certificates for uh, You know like bill of sales for homes, you know pink slip for cars, you know different contract type um, you know paperwork so we we go and we take paperwork and we eliminate it right we eliminate paperwork and we be it we're able to actually convert stuff into digital uh, smart contracts so we we would you know with internet if I was envisioning with internet computer I would think of it like this I would say we go into internet computer create a canister for a smart contract for a certificate of sale for a home and we would use like origin to create the actual certificate or the uh, the bill of sale or the pink slip or you know like property um, anything associated with that property so like say if you had a home and you know you could actually tie in into the certificate with you know your home your bill of sale for your home your mortgage you know uh, your property taxes like everything associated with that home water bills um, everything would go into this smart contract so essentially you would pull up a smart contract that had your your house and then um, you would actually be able to get in touch with everything that's tied to that smart contract and basically take care of everything through that individual smart contract so this is like thinking outside the box but when I look at a project like origin this is essentially what the power that this project has uh, to be able to create something like that so super interesting and so when I look at the technology side of internet computer, one of the main things I really wanted to touch on is that, you know, internet computer is constantly uh, moving forward in their roadmap to just uh, continue integrating and to, to continue expanding um, the network so that, um, you know, as they, they continue to move forward into a global adoption and, you know, they have node providers that are essentially all over the world and these node providers launch access to internet computers so that um, you know it's accessible to you know every country and every state around the globe so what they do is uh, you know they they basically set up node providers and, and allow people to to you know provide nodes to be able to access internet computer and the unique thing about it is they're constantly having that in their their mind going forward so you know, right now, currently, the node providers don't have access to be able to see um, how their nodes are operating. So what they're doing inside their roadmap is integrating, um, you know, additional um, layers to their node providers to be able to generally see how the operation is. Because obviously they want to be uh, the number one in world computer. So having the accessibility to be able to see you know how your node is functioning because without having that uh, node properly working they will run into issues and essentially they don't want to have that to happen so what they're doing is if you go into 
um, you know, their roadmap and you look at uh, the future of internet computer, they're upgrading, um, you know, software to be able to run uh, programs to these node providers to, to be able to basically manage the health of, of the nodes that they're providing. So these are very important elements for internet computer because, you know, thinking forward and, you know, maintaining a structure of um, being able to provide these nodes and, and at a high quality is essential for internet computer to be successful because this is basically the heart of how internet computer is able to scale globally and you know upgrading this and having this in their mind and in the forefront is going to be able to take internet computer to be able to run seamlessly throughout the entire globe so when it comes to technology i mean internet computer is essentially um, you know putting the world computer at the forefront being able to allow users from across the globe to participate in decentralized apps to participate in you know data democracy um, essentially everything that's tied to the internet ICP is basically putting that into perspective for everybody to be able to use utilize it globally so this is going to be one of the biggest hottest projects in 2024 i can guarantee that and you know and if i think forward ahead of time you know i'm thinking like eventually we'll see internet computer um start uh bringing in projects like you know xrp or quant or stellar uh xlm you know these types of projects uh to initially build within the you know the cross-border payments um, you know, projects like Render, where all these projects come in and, you know, the functionality of Internet becomes live and becomes true through Internet computer. And this is one of the reasons why I'm going to get into these price predictions for Internet computer for 2024, because of all the utility that's just it's an overabundance of utility for Internet computer that there's just no way you could get, you know, take Internet computer out of the top 10 cryptocurrencies. And once it reaches that that milestone, it's gonna push its way, you know, right below Ethereum or maybe even bypass Ethereum. I don't know because, you know, it's just everything that goes into Internet Computer is far beyond any other project that's out there today. So let's let's talk about the price prediction for Internet Computer. So when I look at the price prediction for Internet Computer, I'm not looking at a price prediction based on, uh, you know, the uh, the I guess the uh, the community because obviously communities are really strong for projects, but when I look at inter com internet computer, I'm looking at the, this price prediction for internet computer because of the type of technology that uh, internet computer has, uh, because the, you know, the system that is being built, um, the grants that are put out for uh, decentralized apps to be built. And with this type of ecosystem and this type of structure and um, internet computer being a world computer system um, that's constantly evolving their technology is just getting better and better um, and then everything they're integrating within internet computer their launch pad their staking mechanism um, you know all this is very positive for internet computer and when it comes to utility I mean the sky is the limit when it comes to utility so when I talk about this price prediction it's not a price prediction that I'm pulling out of a hat it's based on data. It's based on information. Um, if you want to see some of the data and information and technology, go ahead and check out some of my videos. Um, they're all throughout this uh, video. They have there's cards on there or you could actually check them out and then I'll throw some at the end. But what I'm saying is my price prediction for Internet computer is based on the technology that Internet computer has. So when I'm looking at a price prediction for 2024 going into 2025 and, you know, I put this out there. You know, I'm going to I'm going to put it in a range and I think this range um, is, is realistic. But, you know, I also have, um, you know, an optimistic uh, type of uh, uh, price prediction for Internet computer. But if I stay within the realistic range where I think Internet computer can go, I would say that, you know, by the end of 2024, you'll be seeing anywhere from three hundred and fifty dollar to five hundred and eighty dollar internet computer and then going into if our bull run extends out into 2025 i think that this could go from anywhere to six to eight hundred dollar internet computer and maybe even higher than that and that's just on a more optimistic but you know what i my target essentially because uh you know we've seen some 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 movement in internet computer 
I do think that, you know, realistically, that we will see anywhere from 350 to 570, 580 because of just the technology, the utility, the adoption. And, you know, people need this. I mean, we all need this because if we want to function in a Web3 decentralized space, this is what we need, you know, essentially. So those would be my price prediction or my price targets for 2024 and 2025. You know, but more realistically in 2024, I'm looking, like I said, 350 to 570 uh, internet computer. All right, guys. So I hope you got something out of this video. I just really wanted to touch on, you know, some key points to internet computer. Uh, you know, there's there's really a big demand for a project like this because, you know, when you think about it, we, we need that decentralized uh, internet computer, you know, world computer uh, type cryptocurrency that's going to allow us to be able to utilize you know different blockchains different cryptocurrencies from different blockchains and you know we need that that outlet uh to be able to you know do functions and transactions and you know basically keep internet decentralized and this is what we're trying to move towards and you know internet internet computer has provided you know that with uh, you know for us with everything on chain and you know it just makes it a lot easier to be able to function with a, a cryptocurrency blockchain that is run 100 percent on chain so you know when i look at internet computer and i talked about the price predictions you know this is really a realistic area that i could potentially see internet computer going to so keep that in mind especially if you're invested in it we're still early you know right now it's at eight dollars and some change you know we've seen it go up to 11 it was sitting at three dollars four dollars for eons you know and now we start to see some real traction come out of internet computer and this is all a reflection off of everything that they've done with their project so make sure you get invested in internet computer <clears throat> not financial advice but i highly recommend this project for you make sure you guys check out the 10x squad right now i'm running a 20 dollar entrance fee to get into the 10x squad and this is going to go beyond um you know through new years so make sure you check that out and I hope you guys enjoyed this. So make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one.